My name is Rachel Winston. And I'm Grayson Williams. And, and we're, we're at Fort Sumter in a castmate. Fort Sumter was named after Thomas Sumter, who was a rev Revolutionary War patriot. Fort Sumter is located in the Charleston Harbor. The first shots were fired on April 12, 1861. They fired for 34 hours, yet no one died. It was originally constructed in 1829. U.S. Major Robert Anderson occupied the unfinished fort in December of 1860, following South Carolina's secession from the Union. Six to seven million bricks were made by the slaves in Charleston. Robert Anderson soon evacuated while Private Howell was the first death of the Civil War. This was on accident. It had a final total of 72 guns mounted. On April 7, 1863, war came to Fort Sumter. This is when the Unions attacked. They attacked for two and a half hours. This was the wake-up call for the Confederates, and it strengthened the fort. In August, the Union fought through Morris Island, getting to Fort Sumter with stronger guns. This was the longest siege in U.S. history.